Vinh Thanh Hoàng Lạp Sư. I'm very pleased to welcome you to Kuti Tunnels. Giới thiệu các bạn, tôi là một trong những du khách Kuti còn sống trong một cái căn. We would like to introduce to you that he's one of few Kuti guerrillas who survived from the war. Hôm nay tôi sẽ giới thiệu các bạn về quá trình hình thành, phát triển tác dụng của đại đạo Kuti. Uh, today, uh, we would like to introduce to you the uh, map of the tunnels and uh, the construction of the tunnels. This is Kuchi District. We are in this position now. Benden uh, complex. Uh, they have different places, but this is Benden. ตัวใหญ่ที่ทางทิศตะวันตกของเมืองเชียงใหม่ 60 Yellow areas, they were residential areas con uh, you know, controlled by South Vietnam and uh, U.S. forces. Uh, the pink areas at night, the Kong was very active. But daytime, they mainly controlled by, uh, you know, South Vietnamese army and uh, U.S. forces. Uh, Auburn and uh, U.S. forces stay in the blue areas. Trong Yu Base, where U.S. Uh, 25th Division station. Yeah, so you see black line, the tunnel system. So uh, the first tunnel was built right here in uh, Tung Phu Chung village in 1940s. kilometers in total if you combine all the tunnels in one straight line. Yeah, no machines to dig the tunnels. We just use the hoe or the shovel and the metal basket. And uh, they carry the uh, dirt from digging from the tunnel to the ground in this. Yeah, you can see the diagram on the other side where he would like to show you the details. Yeah, if you want to move to the other side, or you can sit there and. So, there were three levels. Uh, the first level here about uh, 9 feet to 12 feet deep. Uh, the second level about 18 feet. And the third about 25 to 30 feet. Uh, the bunkers on the top here about are uh, seven feet underground. Meeting room, dining room, kitchen, so when I cook in this kitchen, the smoke came to the nearby bunkers and they kept the smoke in there. And the smoke came out, it's discharged further away from the kitchen where they cooked. And they had the bushes on the top and they can disperse the smoke from cooking. <coughs> yeah. So they named this kitchen Huang Kam after the name of the man who invented this kitchen, how to conceal the smoke in the French war. Uh, it's the clinic. It's the air shaft. 
Let me like write it out. The uh, secret entrance to the tunnel from the ground. Uh, so they can uh, keep weapons and food in the bunker like that. And they build a lot of fighting trenches that zigzag on the ground. A fighting bunker. And other bunkers. If they have the good terrain along the river, they can build the underwater exits or entrances along the river uh, over there. Every uh, entrance from one to the other level, they have the, uh, uh, the lid or the cover to prevent the water or the gas that U.S. Uh, soldiers spray or pump into the tunnels. It's the well where they can scoop the water for drinking and cooking. Uh, normally the tunnel is very narrow like this, but they had many places that were much smaller than the regular one, or we can call it the choke locations, like a bottleneck, that can slow down the American terrorists when they went down the tunnels. So in this structure here, uh, the uh, levels were linked together and the bunkers were linked with the tunnel so they can move from one to another place easily inside the tunnel. Thanks to this structure, uh, it's very good place for them to hide and it's also a very good place for them to launch the attacks into the enemies. So, uh, if you like to have any question about his time or the tunnel or personal life, you can ask him before we stand up and uh, walk to see the tunnels. Yeah. Uh, my friend, one of my friends, yeah, was here, yeah, looking for you in the tunnels. Yeah. No, find them. Yeah. <laughs> never, never see them. Ne never. Ông nói là ông có một người bạn hồi xưa cũng là cựu chiến binh à, à, chiến đấu ở chiến trường Củ Chi á, ông đó là giống như là trụ địa đạo á, đi xuống truy tìm nhưng mà ông tìm không có, ông không có gặp người du kích ở dưới này. Thanh Lộc Lát. Bạn ông tìm được du lịch gì cộng không? Không. Không. Yeah. <cười> they, they knew how to hide. Yeah, they, yeah. That's what he said. And he knew how to <laughs> escape before the enemies came. So he said when the tunnel rats went out, they went to the bunker, uh, the vehicle already escaped. Uh, they, 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 they traveled all the way here. And they had the cover close. Yeah, every section they left, they had the cover to close. Camouflage well. Yeah. But tunnels cannot go too deep inside. Too dangerous to go very deep inside the tunnel. Yeah. So how long does it take to build a tunnel? Or how long did it take to build a tunnel system like that? I know they built on for many years, but uh, I can ask him. Trung bình thí dụ mà cái tốc độ mình đào địa đạo nó như thế nào? Chúng ta mình cái tốc độ tùy ở đây, các cái này tùy mùa nắng mùa mưa. Dạ, nếu mà trung bình mùa nắng thì sao? Mùa nắng thì cứ năm người một tổ. Dạ. Dạ. Địa đạo đào địa đạo phải năm người. Dạ. Trong một tổ, một người đào, một người lấy đất từ địa đạo ra. Dạ. Cái 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 hàng này. Dạ. So he explained the speed of digging. In the team of five, two digging, three carrying the dirt and move the dirt out of the tunnel system. Uh, let's say one day, team of five can finish the tunnel just uh, four meters, so about 12 feet long. With like this, 
height like this, large enough for the Vietnamese guy to go through, but only 12 feet a day for five people. Yeah. Slow. Yeah. 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 If you want to have any question about his personal life, he's very open. Anything. Yeah. Did your wife and children work in, uh, stay in the tunnel with you? Yeah, he said that uh, his uh, uh, children, the first two, born in the clinic here in uh, 70 and 72. I think they had no electricity, so no entertainment, so they make a lot of babies in the tunnels too. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No radio, no TV. Yeah, yeah. Anything you can, uh, you can ask them. Yeah. When did you know the war was over, and what was it like for you to experience that? Uh, bác cảm nhận được là mình chiến thắng ở chiến trường này là giai đoạn nào? Có nghĩa là mình cảm thấy tự tin và chắc không, chắn là trong Bắt đầu vô chiến đấu là tôi có cái lòng tin chúng tôi sẽ thắng yeah. Nhưng mà cái năm nào là cũng giống như bước ngoặt mà chú cảm nhận Không, nhận cái đó thì tùy theo cái tình hình chiến trường yeah. Có những lúc năm yeah. 72 yeah. Yeah. Đã, cũng cảm đã cảm... thành chiến thắng rồi yeah, yeah. Nhưng mà năm 75 là chính xác nhất yeah, yeah. Là chiến trường từ những, những chiến trường diễn ra yeah. Yeah. Mình thắng từng yeah. hành, từng yeah. giai đoạn yeah. Tiến tới thắng yeah. hoàn toàn yeah. Thì lúc đó năm 75 mới, yeah. mới cụ thể hơn uh, He said that uh, <coughs> He had the feeling of winning this war The first time in 72 you know, uh, They had in uh, Kong Tong, in uh, Wan Chi yeah, In Unlock Because they had very, you know, big number of uh, Uh, NVA from the north and the Viet Cong with the tanks and big amount of weapons coming from communist countries but they did not win in uh, that year but he felt that they will win the war uh, with certainty in 75 because Hue Da Nang collapsed, Central Highlands collapsed so he felt that that year they must win the war And when uh, they won the war, he's very, very excited with the outcome of the war. He said, won the war. Bắt nguồn từ cái lòng tin chúng tôi sẽ thắng đó. Bắt nguồn từ nguyên nhân là cuộc chiến đấu của chúng tôi được nhân dân trong nước và nhân dân thế giới ủng hộ. Trong đó có nhân dân Mỹ. He said that in uh, throughout the war, he's uh, very confident because he uh, noticed the support from a lot of people in Vietnam and the uh, people in other countries. Yeah. Mỹ thì muốn đánh nhanh thắng nhanh. Yeah. Chúng tôi thì chiến tranh theo kiểu du kích. Yeah. Làm tiêu hao. Yeah. Tiêu hao yeah. từ 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 từ. Yeah, he said that uh, American uh, in general U US army wanted to win a war quickly. And uh, Viet Cong The communists uh, wanted to have the long war. In English, we say sap the energy of the enemy. You know, they uh, persistent, uh, resilient. You know, they uh, they wanted to fight a long war, but maybe Americans, you know, impatience. They wanted to do it quickly, so they wanted to have a longer war. It's better for their side. Ngoài cái tự lực của bản thân nhân dân Việt Nam yeah. còn có sự giúp đỡ của nhân dân thế giới. Yeah. He said that beside uh, Vietnamese people supporting the war, they had a good support from other countries. I think he means the communist countries. Did he hear war protests from Americans? Did he know about that? À bác hồi đó có nghe là ở bên Mỹ người ta cũng biểu uh, tình chống chiến tranh không? Có chứ. Yeah. He said that when he was here in the war, he also heard about the demonstration against the war in the U.S. Có nhiều khách du khách Mỹ hỏi hỏi chú rằng ông nghĩ sao về người dân Mỹ? Chú mới trả lời họ rằng trong chiến tranh chúng tôi xác định rõ ràng do chính quyền Mỹ lúc bấy giờ gây chiến tranh ở Việt Nam, chứ nhân dân Mỹ đâu có đến Việt Nam để gây chiến tranh. 
yeah. nhưng thông qua là tiếng nói Việt Nam ở Hà Nội yeah. à, chúng tôi còn được biết thêm và nhân dân thế giới xuống đường đấu tranh đòi yeah. chính phủ Mỹ chính kiến chiến tranh Việt Nam yeah. trong đó có nhân dân Mỹ uh, he said that uh, at the time uh, even now many people ask him how he uh, think or feel about American people he said that in a war he had radio he also learned that American people civilians demonstrated against the war in Vietnam and he knew that the government made the war not the people so uh, he said that uh, not only people in other countries like European countries demonstrated against the war in Vietnam but also people inside the US demonstrated against the war in Vietnam therefore he can feel very strong uh, confidence good support for his side in this war Yeah. Um, when the Soviet Union yes. and the China helped Vietnam, yes. how was Vietnam uh, fortunate enough uh, that they did not become a puppet country yeah. of Russia yeah. or China? Yeah. Uh, my husband, when the Soviet Union and the một cái nước mà gọi là tay sai hay là một cái nước gọi là thi, mất không. đi cái nhân quyền, mất đi cái cái tự do. Không, chúng tôi không có nghĩ đến điều yeah. đó. Yeah. Tức là trong cái số bạn bè giúp đỡ yeah. các cái nước phe xã chủ nghĩa 14 yeah. nước đó, yeah. thì chúng tôi hay giúp vũ khí, tiền bạc của cải, yeah. thì chúng tôi nhận yeah. với cái nguyên tắc là sau khi kết thúc chiến tranh chúng tôi làm là trả nợ lại từ từ nếu họ đòi yeah. còn họ cho luôn thì cảm ơn họ yeah. còn nếu mà họ giúp người yeah. thì chúng tôi không chấp nhận yeah. vì gì của cải còn làm ra trả yeah. được yeah. chứ con người đâu có trả được yeah. 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 he said that he did not think uh, North Vietnam or communist country here we become a puppet uh, country uh, for Soviet or China because he said he the country here of uh, the communist uh, north received the supplies from those countries to fight and it's just a loan so they will repay later oh. they will repay later not you know uh, receiving uh, you know troops from uh, 14 communist countries to fight here is the reason why he did not believe Vietnam uh, communist North can become a puppet for Soviet or China. Okay. So if they supply Vietnam with the weapons to fight Americans in Auburn here, um, they receive with a condition. We don't want to receive troops yes. and we repay later. Yeah. And if you don't want us to repay, it's good. But if you want to <laughs> get uh, money back, we will repay later. He said that. Yeah. When did he lose his arm? Ah, uh, bác, uh, chú mất cái cái cánh tay là năm nào? Tháng một, một nghìn chín trăm sáu mươi bảy. Ah, January nineteen sixty-seven. Yeah. What happened? Ah, uh, nghĩ là trong cái 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 cái, cái trận nào mà chú? Là... Một lần lính Mỹ cào vào làng yeah. bằng bộ binh yeah. và xe tăng, yeah. chuẩn bị đạn em mà đại liên sáu mươi, yeah. bắn gắn xe tăng bắn bị thương yeah. cái tay. Yeah. Uh, he said that. Uh, um, on the day he lost his arm, uh, U.S. Uh, troops, uh, you know, the infantry and the tanks approach uh, the village where he and other Viet Cong are uh, hiding, uh, living, and uh, the big machine uh, gun on the top of the tank hit him on the uh, right arm, so he's uh, injured, and I think he also got a, a shrapnel on his right eye uh, at that time. Hmm. Chú ở cái làng này. Yeah, he show you the place where he stay yeah, at the top. Yeah. Cái làng Hạng này hoạt động yeah. vườn nhà Yeah, so he stay in the pink area where he just showed and the black line he's showing now where he's uh, hiding and fighting yes. at the time. Yeah. Từ đây tới căn cứ đồng dầu này 4 km. It's only uh, 2.5 miles away from US base on 25th division. Okay, so if you are done, uh, you want to see the real tunnels, yeah. you can say goodbye to him, and then we see the tunnel. <laughs> <laughs>